Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to resolve the Fiat 500 P0301, P0302, P0303, or P004 misfire engine code. Before I come back, please click the subscribe button if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel. I'll be back. This is my 2012 Fiat 500 Sport. The thing is when you have the P0301, uh, P0302, P0303, or P0304, uh, the Fiat 500 will give you the check engine light. What does it mean? Uh, if it shows uh, in your scan tool, what happens is if you have the check engine light on your Fiat 500, you want to get this uh, really cheap OBD2 scanner and plug it into the OBD2 port in your car, which is located on the driver's side. And then if it says the P0301, uh, it means that your cylinder one has an issue uh, in su a sufficient burning, uh, fuel being burned in a cylinder one is detected and it will give you the check engine light uh, you know that, that shows P0301 in the cylinder one if, uh, if it happens in the cylinder two it will show uh, P30 uh, no P302 which is cylinder two and three and so forth anyway uh, you can detect that using a cheap uh, OBD2 uh, Scanner. If you have the Autel Maxicom, which is more advanced, it will tell you exactly which cylinders are having a problem. What happened? Uh, I had this issue a while back. It, sh it shows uh, uh, P0301 and P0303. So that means uh, cylinder one and cylinder three are having the misfire problem uh, the fuel that is being burned in the cylinder one and cylinder three are not enough it's not sufficient and it shows a check engine light yeah this is a really good uh, tool because it show you exactly what's wrong with the car and i'll show you uh why sometimes uh a spark plug just goes bad on you look at this how bad the old spark plugs uh look you know and it's just it burned up and it doesn't uh, burn the fuel as efficient and it will cause misfire if you buy a cheap spark plug this will happen okay that is, that is a really ugly one and also uh, you can fix it by uh, changing the coil pack and the spark plug together and basically uh, this is how it looks in the in the engine cylinder okay so yeah, this is the coil pack and this is the spark plug. Uh, let's say you have the P0301 uh, check engine light. That means you just have to take the spark plug out from cylinder one and the coil pack and replace it with a brand spanking new uh, spark plug and coil pack. Sometimes only the spark plug goes bad, but I always change both of them to make sure that, you know, the, the issue really goes away. So anyway, and I want to show you something you're probably wondering which one is the cylinder one which one is the cylinder two which one is the cylinder three and four okay uh, let's open it up here we go okay if you watch my uh, video on uh, changing the fiat spark plugs and coil pipe video uh, the spark plug uh, I, I encourage you to go to my video the spark plug is located right here just have to remove the engine cover and remove the air box and the spark plug uh, a sequence it goes like this uh, this is cylinder one cylinder two cylinder three and cylinder four if you uh, have problem with cylinder one p0301 you have to 
uh, change the spark plug and the coil pipe on the if you live in the United States you have to go from the passenger side that's the uh, first one number one is always in the US okay if the you know always in the passenger side the uh, cylinder one if you live in UK where people drive on the wrong side no, no just kidding on the <laughs> passenger side the spark plug will be in the driver side okay so it, it always goes like one two three four from left to right understand so if, if it's a p0304 that's a spark plug number four so it'll be like the last one on the right side cylinder one is always uh, the first one on the left side the second cylinder is the second one to the left side and the third one of course you know the second one from the right side it's like one two three four anyway did you get that so anyway uh you're probably wondering where is the obd2 port where you can uh, plug the scanner i'll be back hi everyone the obd2 port on the fiat 500 is on the driver's side but there is only one way in and one way out that part is always on the top just connect it right there and then turn on the car and let it read at this point since there is no uh, check engine light uh, there will be no code look at that except I'm not wearing my seat belt which is you know you have to to do it so basically that's how you uh, diagnose the P0301 P0302 P0303 or the P0304 uh, you can just uh, fix it by replacing the spark plugs uh, or coil pipe the thing is uh, if the problem persists you may have to go to a fiat mechanic there may be some uh, vacuum leak that can also trigger the p030 you know uh, one two three four so anyway uh that's the easiest way to diagnose it it's, if you have a fiat 500 or fiat arbat so anyway uh make sure you give this video a thumbs up and click the subscribe button if you haven't subscribed to my youtube channel love you guys bye